Hello, YouTube. Hello, YouTube. And Facebook. I'm glad you're here. We had a bit of a... a oh, jeez, man. That's not working. Um, Let us know how the sound is on YouTube, Facebook. Yes, we are... We are testing a microphone tonight to see if we're getting any better sound. So let us know. Yes, you can see. For those diligent, you can see the mic is right here. Well, I'm not supposed to I'm ruin it like Disney magic. Like, you're not supposed to tell them how it works. The mic is here. I sh maybe shouldn't have told yeah. you. I mean, sitting here not being able to see. Can't see you guys. Why can't I see? <laughs> oh, okay. I can see again. Hello, welcome. Hello. Come tell us if we're here. We need to know. Um, Bianca's here. But Bianca's hello, always here. Bianca. Bianca's always here and she's here. She actually comments generally before we actually yes. start. Hello, Bianca. How did the operation go? I think the, the hubby had an operation. How did that go? Anyway, say hi if you're here. Uh, pop us a message, pop some emojis. Yeah. If want to know if you're here. Um, and meanwhile, we are waiting for people. Maybe you can start by telling them what we are and who we are and why we are. Ashley says, I'm here. Ashley, hello. Okay, so I'm Amanda and this is Create with Fabric 8. And we try and do this every week and mostly on a tuesday but um you, you never know what the future holds so we might change it but you'll get notice on that and we are from a company called fabric with the number eight and we um have sewing knitting crochet supplies we've got some craft supplies and we are online stores so um you welcome to go have a look at www.fabric the word and the number eight dot co dot za and we we try and get we also try and get new things and things other people don't have or to be your like one-stop shop so we are expanding our um, product range the whole time i think we are currently on about two and a half thousand products it could it could be more because we just recently added a ton of wool new wools so if you guys are into wool we are busy now at this moment currently uh, uploading new wool so within the week it should be up um bianca says embroidery too yeah embroidery machine embroidery hand embroidery i see that as sewing maybe i shouldn't that's why i don't like specifically mention that and then every week we have this this live where i am supposedly your sewing expert and the way i struggled with the sewing machine just now one would never say that but as you can see i have my old uh, manual machine out today because my machine's brain um seems to be confused um i might have confused it <laughs> Because um, even though I tell my pe people who buy sewing machines from me to always read the book, I feel like I might have not read that one. The book was 144 pages. I was Googling it. That's a, that's a lot of pages, man. I know, I'm but gonna... I, I, I feel like I didn't actually read that one's book. And it's slightly above my head when I start with the settings. And I might have set it to a place now. And I'm, I'm, I'm giving it time. <laughs> maybe so maybe the hissy fit get it, it gets over it um and also i'm giving myself time because if if i have this sort of issue be five minutes before the live i lose myself i literally i'm not i'm not well so i just went back to my old Trusty. manual trusted manual machine and i might look very stupid sewing on it tonight because i must now remember to to do things that I never used to have, I don't have to do with the computerized machine. Anyway, um, and I do a, uh, we do Q and A, and it used to be after, but it's right straight through everything now. So if you have any sewing questions, if I find that I need to talk, or it's a difficult subject or a, a, a weighty subject, then I will leave it till after the tutorial. Now talk about the tutorial. We have a tutorial, a sewing tutorial every week where I um, draw up a pattern and I um, 
we publish it on our website for free you can use it you can sell the stuff you buy there is no what's that called Lisa? pay games oh wait, wait. no you weren't listening <laughs> there is no license on it so um it's free Copyright. to use you just can't compete with us <laughs> yeah well there no competitions yours yeah you can't you can't be using my patterns for your life no but anyway um and then um as i said we pop i think i think we're at about 60 patterns already 50 something. something 50 something um and every year we have to clean out the website so we take down the patterns of that year and we are busy um combining it into a book um and then but this year's i mean we already there's quite a few patterns still left on the website um but if you tune in every week you get a free tutorial and um so i said to them this afternoon in real time because real time it's so real that sometimes i find mistakes on my own patterns i have no problem with that and sometimes i actually make mistakes and um it's all out there for you guys to see i don't claim to be super human Yes. Nice. Then I think uh, problem resolved. I don't know. Problem solved. It's, so, it's and also, um, you know, when when you design things, people, people, for instance, this um, little uh, apron that we're making, my body and Lisa's body is so different that on me it seems to fit perfectly, but I am big up. I'm here big and big everywhere so I'm like I always say like well Lisa's small at the top with a tiny waist so this pattern for her um it's it's a little bit chunky at the top so you know you never know and and I always say fit it whatever you're making fit it on the person that's going and I've already made a few adjustments on the pattern just because we are going to pottery classes now and these are actually for tomorrow night for pottery class so um you guys are just um getting a pattern i need it anyway um but we got some hype about this pattern on the whatsapp group and on that no, note, they, they, we have whatsapp group yeah you can go to www.fabric8.0.dx.whatsapp um and you can join any of our like i think six or eight What's yeah we you? have we have a sewing one we have a Noltwerk an Afrikaans Afrikaans and we have um we've got a knitting crochet embroidery uh we also have an update updates group so if you don't want to be on a like a, a chatty social group but you do want to get our updates that is the group to go on because nobody can post on there except us um oh and i never introduced lisa is behind the computer today she's there in your left hand corner if you're on youtube and facebook matthew is keeping me company because we are um upgrading and updating our system the whole time and um i'm lisa too stupid to do that so <laughs> i have to come here and be a face while yeah. lisa does the hard work maybe it's just the face the pretty face um lisa's the one with the brains and the 15 cameras and uh, mic and everything yeah. else so she's just there. setting it all up um and now with the new mic and all the if i don't know if they can't see this we have a, a sky cam a cam a, like a top cam show cam. yeah <laughs> just labeled so um you guys on instagram you are missing out unfortunately instagram does not allow anything except this um what is it called upright vertical, vertical picture we can't add cameras we can't know so if you want to see more and um we have at the moment one two three four cameras and they are all um being used for 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 youtube and facebook do you consider the decent <laughs> face cam as well when then it also, but, yes. is that new glasses they look awesome wow well, did you, you lose do. the weight you're looking great <laughs> Oh, Milan, WTF, I'm going to YouTube now. <laughs> We're going to look for you there. I can Milan, see you uh, waiting Milan. for your comments on Milan, YouTube. Hi, I'm your biggest fan. Is it Milan? What sewing machine do you oh, have? Laura. Laura's also joining in. The Laura. whole family's tuning okay, in. Okay, so Milan is my son. 
and Laura's his girlfriend. So yeah, I know he, he is my biggest fan, one of my biggest. I, I assume I have a few in my kids. Uh, hey Matthew, man, I'm your every a. Hey, I'm your every night man. I don't look like I'm gonna be if I'm really look like business. I'm gonna be washing dishes. <laughs> Anyway, okay, so any questions about our company, about what we stock? Um, I've, have we got anyone that says they knew? I don't we know. Need, we well, need people to say they knew B. Insaf Mohammed69 says, I'm here just for a little bit. Oh, I'm not sure if that Insaf. means that they're new. I do, yes, I don't know. Um, I did a poll on YouTube. Yeah. At least one person said they're a newbie. So I'm reading. Oh, okay, okay. And here tonight. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Kendall Townsend is here. That's a name I haven't heard before. So maybe Townsend, I, I, I had. Uh, why does that surname sound familiar? Guys, let us know. Sandra Curtin is here on Facebook and I've never seen her Hello, name either, Sandra. so she might be new as well. Let us know how the sound is on YouTube and Facebook. We do have a different setup tonight. Yes. We're hoping to come back with even more microphones next week, so hopefully yeah, but we, we individual yeah. sound. Especially you, Bianca. Tell us if the sound is better, because you know you know what it sounds like. Um, the yeah, mic. aiming for noise reduction. Yeah, so less, no trucks. less background, and and when I sew, hopefully also. So sewing should be soft. Yeah. Anyway. And then I should be off in the distance, so I'm kind of shouting, and Matthew and Amanda should be pretty clear. Yeah. Tonight. Yes. Anyway. Also, and you guys can sound is there. fine, says Antoinette. Yes, Thank you, Antoinette. We don't want it to be fine. We want it to be yeah. above fine. And then it must be great. If it's just yeah. fine, that's just not you really guys, doing it. Guys, everything you will not believe. To get one little, you know, like this little what's called pannier, pannier mic or something yeah. it's called. To get one that is wireless. That doesn't, remember, you get a cheapy wireless, but it needs to plug into the bottom of a phone. There's a little unit. Now, we can't, <laughs> which phone would we plug that in? So we can't get the cheapy wireless one. So one microphone wireless is like 3,000 Rand. So I am, are we going to be wired for sound <laughs> for a while still? Because I just cannot. Yeah, no. Yeah, I can see the sound is good just because of my TV, but also on my phone. So I did a sound test beforehand and I also think it's a little soft, but it is because we're using like a body mic as a room mic. Oh. So next week when I did other testing like up close with the microphone, the sound was really nice and loud and clear. Yeah. So next week hopefully. Well, yeah. For now, hopefully this is just an upgrade and then Can you not up the sound? No, is that as loud? I think it's quite loud for us here, though. Like, I mean, for here it was quite loud. Like, it's louder than normal. For this, with us, us too. This is louder than normal. Yeah, yeah. I think it's better than normal. I don't know about the sound because I think we usually add top volume. Well, what we afterwards we can watch it and then we can see. Yeah. So then we'll also anyway. judge. You, you should say you never download, watch your own movies. You guys can download the pattern from www.fabric8.0.0.0 slash create. It's also the link in our bio for our Instagram piece. Uh, lots of free patterns there, lots of free information. And we also have a calendar up there that tells you when we will be live. We usually schedule our lives about a month in advance. So I think we have scheduled every Tuesday except your birthday. For the next month. Exactly. Okay. The yeah. birthday isn't a Tuesday, so that's that, yeah. we're not doing that Tuesday. Yeah. Okay, cool. Well then the next few Tuesdays we're not gonna be here, so no. we're, we're gonna we'll, Oh so neither is Jan, so you're gonna have a, a, a Milan in Pretoria as well, so that you know okay, well, then you should we consider might you, well, Yes, I know Milan and Laura can come and do a guest fair. appearance. Okay, well we we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Lisa needs we'll to see. Lisa must not book Jan without talking to his agent, which is me. Anyway, so let me film a show off our top camera for you guys. You can see what our patterns look like. Pattern? So you're on the top cam. Yes. <gasps> it's top cam. Oh no, you can see my computer. I will move it away. Oh no, I can't move it away. There's a mic. Never yes, mind. No, you no. can just ignore my okay, computer. So, a bit. so if you, when you print out the pattern, it um, will be like this. It's a different color every week, but it has the printing instructions on it. And this one, because it takes 15 pages, I actually put a little picture so that you know, because normally we only have one, two, three, four, five, six, 
so this one's bigger so i actually gave you a little picture to show you how to put it together and then also um we put a picture of what the garment looks like um uh, or... let me switch off the the, the top cam and amanda would just do it spin because um she's got the garment on Wow, 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 wow. And the nice thing, the nice thing is, look at this, is, if I can figure it out quickly. Oh, yeah. I, I'm not sure how you're supposed to get out of it, but it's something like this. Okay, so there's no tying. It's actually easier to get in, but I think you just do that. Voila. So, yeah. That's that's the pattern for tonight, and as I said, it's quite a few. Oh, Matthew, so sorry. sorry. There's quite a few pages, fifteen in all, and the pattern that I don't know if you guys can see, but that is what the pattern looks like. So it's all in one piece, and initially I thought, oh, is this gonna fit? It actually does fit into um, one forty wide fabric. All right, so um, the instructions I gave you is to create one like like this picture um, that does not have the bias binding around, okay? But as you know me, I really like adding color. So the more you can see. the more color, the better. So I'm going to show you how to do the bias binding one. Um, but the instructions show you how to do this one that um, that doesn't have bias binding. Okay, all right. So shall we start? Okay. So the first thing, there's three pattern pieces or four. There's the big oh, piece. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Just said beautiful. Well done, Amanda. And Antoinette said she loves the top piece. Good job, Lisa. So now everyone's doing a great job except for Matthew. Oh, that sounds uh, about right, you know, though. Stop bitching each other <laughs> on the on the line. Well, I never, never you know, you, so. but yeah, I know you know you you. What? <laughs> what children? Oh, okay. Okay, guys. So these four pattern pieces. The one, the one is the obviously the the big one, the actual apron, and there's the pocket, and then there is the two straps, and also a little um, yoke. But the yoke we are not going to use because we are using by spine okay so i'm just showing you a different option all right so that um it's sort of more versatile okay so what did i what did i need to change to be able to do the bias binding let me show you um if you guys like the bias binding version i can actually go um draw in this this little thing that I cut away here, um, because the we can do an update and just add a second pattern piece. Yeah, no, no I'll just go draw that. that line in. I know, but I'll yeah, yeah, yeah. add it one with so, bias binding and one without. Yeah, so the one without bias binding, can you see the back strap? Um, fits in here quite, and it and it's quite wide. So I wanted a thinner strap, and for me to be able to make the thinner strap if you think about that i need that to be cut away so it's a very easy um change so i let's just go there i made the strap that wide okay and they actually need to fit on top of each other so all i did is i did something like that okay mm -hmm. and i cut that off the two back pieces and made the strap a straight same size in the front and same size in the back and the only reason we did that is um, to give it, well firstly to to be able to do the um, the bias binding option um, because on the thicker strap it actually doesn't work so well so you'll see that the method on the thicker strap is slightly different okay so the first thing you need to do obviously you'll see also on the instructions is we need to prepare the little pocket now this this has been done many times in many of our um, uh, tutorials the first thing you do is we do a five or a centimeter roll 
uh, turn and then we turn it bigger so that the top of the pocket is finished and we do a double stitch okay then i just ironed in one centimeter seam allowances and i sewed it down now on ours i've just sewed down two so this i'm thinking is for like um a cell phone and this is if we like maybe for a brush or something i don't know what we're gonna use we still need wee potters what we have invested about two thousand rands <laughs> <laughs> in yeah, yeah. yeah anyway okay so so basically let me explain the pattern to you so this is the front this is this bit okay so obviously i'm gonna just pin it so you can understand how this works because it is a little little bit of a mind uh blown if you don't understand it so we're gonna put the the two front pieces i'm just pinning them to show you guys we don't actually stitch them right on top of this like this just to show you all right so that is our two fronts okay so i'm gonna fold this so that we can see the back so that is what the back will look like with the front straps coming in like that all right so obviously if we just put that strap on this side you'll have like it'll want to fall off you the whole time so at the back these straps they overlap okay just so you see it and understand and then can you see then it's all together your arms go in there and your head comes out there all right okay so with the the vice binding one we, there are some of these um, things that we have to buy spine before we can buy spine the rest, okay? So the first thing is we can't buy spine around a 90 degree corner like that. So we are going to do the one side of the strap and the one side of this strap. We're going to do the bias binding. We're also going to do these, this top. The back top bit and the back top bit. So it's these three front and two backs and one side on each strap. Okay. <clears throat> um, and I'm I'm going to be using the bias binding foot. Uh, we have this um, in stock, and they are it's the one I'm using is actually a generic. Um, we do have the original brother one also. Uh, if I, if I, I always say, say to Lisa, you know, it looks very easy to stand and sew, but you're actually not at the machine level, so you can't, you can't actually see if you are lining up. So there we go. Is that in? That's in. Come on. There we go. So I'm gonna just push it in there and take it a little bit through to my vice binding maker so that it's perfect and I'm gonna drop the foot just what am I doing? yeah okay all right and I'm gonna start with one of the straps um I always just clean up the corner because it actually has to pass through that uh, little vice binding foot so if you have like strings and things that's hanging off it um, it's always a good, um, is, the, is the machine cam on? Yeah. Um, to start, I actually haven't sewn with this machine so long. Yeah, it still sews. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes it's good skin. Oh, how, how should I stick it? I'm just going to move this a little bit. And that's the nice thing about these foot feet, is that it actually fits um, at the back and and the front. Yes. So I'm going to just insert my piece that I want to bind there. It, it's a little bit tricky at the beginning. Oh, it's it's white like noise, white, me at white that noise on this side. Yeah, we, we, we don't hear it because we are so concentrating on other things. Um, okay, well, still the same noise. That's very. No, there, is no noise. <laughs> there is no noise. Oh, is that what they're saying? No, I'm telling you, there is no noise. So yeah. So that must be 
something else then? Could it be the, I don't know. Do a little test. Let's just give it a few seconds. Maybe it's, it's you guys are behind. I mean, a, a bit. Definitely sat. Definitely sat. Yeah? No, definitely, definitely sat. How does that work? If, if there's not one thing goes wrong, everything, everything goes wrong. Yeah, no, this is. It's like. <coughs> um, Matthew, can you please check restream for me? How's that sounds now? And then the static sound that's only appearing on okay the... but that could be the mic could it not no it's it's instagram okay is but restream but restream is back and we're i think well, let me just check i'm, I'm not live. back on youtube hello not... youtube i'm not done yet so you haven't missed a bit at all i'm still i'm still sewing the bits that we um said we were gonna sew. matthew um is it static or feedback no, it's static. And like it was, it, the, the mic wouldn't do it because it wasn't connected to, into Instagram. Yeah, yeah. Do we know that about mics? Yes. Like the mic wouldn't be causing, like, that's, that, that has nothing to do with that. Is there not a thing about a mic next to another mic and then it causes feedback? No. That's not the no. Okay. All right. Okay, people saying they're going back to YouTube. Yeah, just here on Instagram. Yeah, guys, it's just on Instagram. We'll try and figure it out another time. But yes. Is it loud? Cheer, goodbye. What? Is it loud or is it like an annoying? What could that be? I will play it for you if you want. No, I don't. I just want an answer. It's quite, it's quite annoying. It... But what? That's something. We've never had that. That's something completely new. Completely new problem. Can you guys still hear it now? Can you still hear it? I mean, there's only two people on. Check no. it. You're new children. I'm listening. I, it's still there, but it's softer. It's softer. It's definitely softer. Back from the mic. guys we we as i said it never rains it pours we bomb out on youtube and uh, facebook and then suddenly instagram we've, which we've been doing the same way for two years now um decides that it's gonna do something also not liquor and i'm telling you this is this there's a genie somewhere in someone's bloody bottle okay so all i've done is can you see i've done that top i've done this top bit and i have done that top bit and then the two pieces of two one side on each strap okay so what i'm gonna do is i'm just cutting these the straps we can just cut off um right at the edge all right and for this we're gonna need our normal 15 foot on quickly because we're gonna just fix the strap so we can do the round and round um yeah so we can do that all that long bits in one go okay so with with my strap onto the back um the you'll see that the pattern does actually suggest that you overlock or even just zigzag all around the pattern 
so that we don't have to turn turn that and worry about that it, it's just going to be on the inside obviously if you're making this and you don't want to um, see overlocking um, on the inside then um, I would suggest you you actually turn and and I make it pretty it's we've just connected a new media capturing device and it's actually uploading a CPU seriously so I took a camera off and it's working now. Oh. So we have to test that new phone. Yeah. Well, you can take the mic off. I mean... No, it's fine. I already took the camera off. I think your mom might be right about the mic feedback. It's the only thing that, that makes sense. Which I but just... We're not talking about that. Yeah, yeah. I know. I, mean, I mean, the other one. We're yeah. talking about Instagram also. Okay. So can you see? I've just pinned them like that. Just so that I can get this side seam to align because what's going to happen now is I am going to put vice binding all the way around okay so I'm just on the right on, on the right side and guys I know that I should be using a different color thread but I always like doing um using white thread or a contrast thread for you guys so you can actually see me sewing so what I'm going to do is, on the front it looks like this, can you see? So I'm just going to, at the top, just sew the, that down. Bernice Bolton says, I hi on Facebook and sorry I'm so late. Ah, oh, Bernice, yes, but she have, uh, you, you are forgiven. I didn't say no one in YouTube or no one on Instagram before mentioned the static until the YouTube people went there. Yeah. Instagram people were quiet. They didn't say a thing about that. And then it says Amanda the Rebel. <laughs> I didn't. I don't. I wasn't paying enough attention to know what that's in reference to. I, don't, I mean, I'm okay. So that one is. Oh, sorry. That one is done, and I'm going to do this one. And it just makes it so that I don't have to do a hundred um, uh, corners and fit together. Um, it just makes it easier if I do as look and I'm, 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 I'm forgetting to actually press the right reverse button. And bring my needle up. See, I'm, I'm slightly um spoiled with my other machine okay so if you look at it now let me show you um that's that's what i've done okay obviously guys this is a look if you like more of a classic sort of japanese look the the way i do it in the um in the instructions is obviously more your thing all right I just like bright, bright and beautiful things. So I, yeah. All right. So what I'm going to do now is see, this is what I like is now I am. So you're a rebel because of the different color thread. Oh, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So let's just see. This is. <laughs> Just get these nicely cut also. Whoop, whoop. I'm only gonna do one side, guys, because um I mean this is not going there, Amanda. This is going on the other side on this. I'm just oh, didn't want to work out. Perfect. Let's see. It gets a little bit confusing, but it doesn't matter. You just have to do all the edges with bias bind. Okay, so guys. I'm going to sew again now, put my bias binding foot back on and if you guys have any questions or anything um, you can ask me while I'm sewing because it's a little bit boring if I'm just sewing and nobody's talking. Well last time you sewed the entire um, streaming software collapsed so I didn't think I was boring. Yeah, stop, <laughs> never sew. <Yeah. laughs> I'm looking at the um, the CPU stuff now and there, and I still don't fully understand this because it says percentage CPU, but I'm thinking it means percentage CPU use. Yes. So if it's 
case OBS uses 65, it's 65 of the U, not 65 of the Mac. I can look at it on Mac. I think so because then at the bottom it says it's got an idle 7 gigabit. Why would there be an idle anything that, if we are using it? No, that, that's not right? used, yes. Okay. So then it wasn't the CPU, it was just OBS fraction. Okay. So flip it now. No, no, well, that's b better news, guys. I have a brand new computer. It would be uh, very sad. Um, Bianca says, maybe, um, Amanda, you should maybe have a seat there by you. You know, he is an old lady. Oh. She can't stand very long. She has a seat. I have a seat, but I can't sit because there is a pole he saw where my bienen moet gaan. There is a... <coughs> See? There is no place for my legs to go. So, guys, so sorry, we, we, we've been having internet issues for the past four weeks, and I have had, as I said, we spoke to two guys today, I don't know what I'm doing, because this seems to want to, oh, there we go, there we go, um, two guys here, and um, so we're hoping to um, sort our internet problems soon. And then hopefully jump onto a new problem. Get, yeah, get, <laughs> we, we, we sort of done with this problem now, mate. Can we just get something else? So, um, yeah, strangely. Yeah, but it bombs out again now. It is definitely this, this camera. Did you put it back on? I don't think it is. But I'm doing it to see what the CPU is doing. Anyway. Oh, well. We are sending creative emojis in the chat. What? Who's doing? What is going on? Slamming emojis. Yes, guys. More of that. <laughs> more. And then smash that like button. <laughs> and slap the subscribe button. And See, tune in that. every week. Tune in. that dang. Seven. Fifty shades of rainbow, yeah. Right. <laughs> We, we, are, we, we are not for grey. I am not for grey. Or whatever the white colour, black, whatever. We are 50 shades of the brightest colours available. We are the gradients. No, I'm not a gradient. I am I am a rainbow. I, the brighter, the better. I find um, the world very, very dull. bleak and dull. Why would you... Not that I wear that, that many bright colors. It's just that I like color. But I'm an 80s teenager. Maybe that's the reason. Smash to the like button, guys. Is this still so incorrectly? Yeah. I can see there are people watching us. That are, that are exactly talking. Yeah, guys, surprisingly enough, 50% of our viewers are not subscribed to the channel. So please actually subscribe because, you know, just because it helps boost the channel yeah, and that. I, I saw that people are getting like gold and silver thingies from YouTube, guys. Yeah, like, a million like, we need this. Come on. We are 900,898 900, <laughs> subscribers. It's, it's like. It's like literally just, just a few more, man. Just a couple, and we'll get to a million, and then we'll be famous. Yeah, million. Which is all. ultimately what this is all about. Yeah, fame. absolutely, absolutely. I've always wanted to be famous, like on, on people's screens. Millionaire Knopf goes whoop whoop eighties, <laughs> <laughs> and Sue Walters goes evening, ladies. Hello, Sue. Okay, guys, listen, uh, are you all actually better at this than me? So you don't need me to help you with any questions? <laughs> I think most of them watch it later. They come for the vibes. Oh, okay. But but other questions, come on. Are you coming for the vibes? So it's just my awesome personality. Yeah, personality. What is, what is that, that chat GPT thing? No, oh, there was like a couple like dancing and... No, it didn't because I can't remember because I'm too tired to remember what happened yesterday. Extravaganza. 
Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to well. stop here and, and give it a little bit of a tail because I'm going to have to um, possibly later um, get this in, in another corner. But I, I can't remember which corners it is, so I just leave that and then I will come back to sew it if I need to because I don't want to uh, sew it and then have to unpick it. Um, you can press it back. Bianca into asking a question. Yeah. She wants to know where can she get the blue bias? Do we not have it? Huh? Run, <laughs> run, run. Look quickly. This is actually now that you mention it, this is blue. Lisa told me it's freaking purple. And, and and no, that's this and and but then by that when we did that. <laughs> We hadn't um, had the streaming lights on, so it was getting dark. So probably... It still looks a little purple to me, I'm going to be honest with yeah, you. Yeah, but not here. It's actually blue. Okay, so can you see that I've done that whole... That whole curve, all right? Okay, so we're also going to do that, this whole curve. Because then this strap is done. And once this strap is done... Um, can you see why I left this little flap here? Because now, when we do this, when we attach the strap, like that, um, I'm going to just pin it so I can show you. So before I finish the other side of the strap, I'm going to attach the strap. I see I um, need to actually... Sue so that's the same color. So we have blue and we have purple. And we have turquoise. And Bianca um, said she doesn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bianca said she didn't see it. So what do they search on Fabric A to get it? The bias binding. Maybe it's only in that side. I'm gonna do a search and I'll send it if I find it. Okay, just to show you. So that's why I left this little flap. So what I'm going to do now is once I, because this is now, see, I'm doing the first one. Okay. So I'm going to, oh, and this is the pain with the bias. Oh, it's one of those evenings. I'm working on a manual machine. All right. So I'm going to do that quickly. Same as the front. I'm just going to sew it down and um what color would you paste that? this is bloody blue now that i see it it's purple no. blue it's definitely not purple this is like a red you, okay you've got dark blue dark, dark turquoise blue. dark blue bright blue these are okay bright oh. blue again this dark. this is i don't know could be navy what is there um, oh, here's the link, guys. I sent it to you. It's, does it have? Can you see the uh, the size? SKU. Yeah. What is the SKU? For bright blue. Mm. Bio, no bias off. Like bright blue. Yeah, I can see the code. It's not bright blue. Okay, bright blue is the color you're looking for. Oh five eight. Okay, guys, look at On this. On the twelve millimeters. So now I'm um, that I've done that. I can just fold my binding back like that. There we go. And just finish the binding quickly. That's why I stopped because I knew that it's better to. There we go. And I is, don't is this not 25 millimeters? This is this one, which is my, this is 25 mil. Oh, so I did send the right link. Okay, yes. cool. I'm going to resend it. But we also have 19 and we have another one. Can't remember. Wow. Okay. Um, Sue Walters Pizza asks, what are you seeing? What am I? What are you seeing? Sewing. Uh, oh, that's probably what she means. Yes, you probably misclicked. Yes, what are you sewing? Uh, we are sewing a Japanese style apron like i've got on um, i'll show you the back right now 
What? I'm gonna say go off I'll put it on the screen and I forgot to do this. Oh. And so it's it, this this style. Um and it crosses the back like this. And putting it on and taking it off. Um we still have to figure that out. Oh actually, you know what? You're supposed to take your oh, there we go. You take your arms out and then so it actually oh, that's how you get in also. Look. So you put it over your head and then your arms and what's nice about it is you don't have strings to tie and i absolutely hate it when something singes in my waist um okay so obviously that is the one side done um now what i'm going to do is i'm going to just do that whole long vice binding on this side and then i'm going to get confused and attach this one and do its long bias binding and there we go then it's a meet the hem and it's done so i will um keep on sewing and um if you guys have any questions now would be the time to do it to ask me okay so let me just start on this side just get this done. I'll also put a picture of what we're making on the screen for you guys. Like I promise I would. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so as I said to you guys, obviously I am a little bit more out there. So this this is not what it would look like if you make it like a Japanese style, which is that um that looks like sort of like a crushed cotton that they made it from so it's very sort of what is that style like vanilla i'm not supposed to say that um like i don't know it's probably the oh minimal minimal yeah less is more i don't really understand uh, no color I'm sure we're going to lose some people now to the eight o'clock load, Jenny. And for those people, goodbye. It will be saved on YouTube and everywhere yeah. else afterwards. You can watch it there. Cheers. Antoinette asks, do you do any other needle crafts? Me? Yeah. At this moment? Um... Is that like acupuncture? start doing that punch needling that looks fun but no no i don't really um i'm trying to think i know i do i, I like sewing i've always liked sewing and um i also don't like uh, funny enough i don't like stretch fabrics so a lot of people ask me about stretch foot and i know i literally am john snow i know nothing what do you um, no 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 i'm just i'm going on as i said i've explained it i'm just going to do the other side while we talk um so that we can yeah uh, it's a very easy pattern and um i mean i'm just i'm doing the same thing that i just did changing the foot sewing the other thing on and um just literally by finding all around um would you ever consider doing sample clothing like they no. do, used to do in Harlem Eck in the 80s? Like mini pockets? Oh, pockets oh, uh, you mean like... Recently got my aunt's collection from her exam folio in 83 and it's so cool. Um, yeah, it's, it's, I think it's called the sample book. Yeah. Um, we might do that because we want to make an online course. Yeah, but my, progress while my, we do my course my online course as it stands has all of that in it yes it's just not online <laughs> yes. yes yeah no it no it's not but i mean while we're shooting that we can do like single ones out of it yeah um interesting question why would you need that have do you need to to learn those types of things or are you just commenting on that it's Cool and I don't know. Tanya Egerson says hi. Okay. Why? What? Tanya Egerson says hi. Oh, okay. Um, I don't know. 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 Um, I don
because of that tie around my uh, around my waist because i've never actually worn anything well that yeah so to me something in my waist is actually quite uncomfortable um so i yeah i don't i don't like oh i just i'm doing a vice binding without a vice binding just by the way this is what happens when you talk so um, it's going to be a little bit more skewed than it <laughs> It could have been. No one should look that drunk. Yeah. No one. <laughs> no. Um, I think if you make this in like jeans fabric, yeah. it's a good like dry. Yeah, but dry it's, 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 again, it's a perfect gift for someone. Um, and you can even, you know, like have their names embroidered onto it. Or you know, but this guy, Jan Bry, and oh, we do lots of cool people yeah um we got some more messages yo um ashley says yeah she would like to learn and then keep it as a reference oh yeah yeah I, it's funny enough um i have that and but i actually never referenced it i um because because that doesn't have actual instructions after you've sewn it so what i normally did is if they there are certain things that i um that i can't go without having to go have a look um and those things i used to as i said to you guys i i bought myself the reader's digest um ultimate ultimate sewing yeah and um they actually have piece for piece instructions and um I used to use that because as I said the samples don't have you know instructions next to it uh, but I mean I suppose one can write it but I'm just yeah oh. but also you know um, I don't want to say this because I'm, I'm an old person but uh, YouTube is your friend I mean I I still today watch YouTube things and I go like oh I never. Why is that so easy? We, I, I was taught like the most difficult way to do this, and so, um, yeah. So I, you know, a Google a beginner's course, and then use the things that they say in there, or take your grandmother's book, and if it says it's going to start with an open seam, closed seam, French seam, things like that, and then you have the words and you just google how to make an open seam how to do a closed seam and then also in that google why and what is the difference between an open and a closed seam and um what when would you use a french seam and things like that so we we, we are gonna have an online course sometime but I mean, I can't even give you an estimate because, Not yo, we are, we are <laughs> overworked, and, overworked overwhelmed. and under freaking fight. Um, Antoinette asks, is the booklet still coming with all the patterns from last year? Um, absolutely. Work in progress. Yeah. Absolutely. Yes. Keep asking us and we'll still all break to the finish. <laughs> but yes. Okay, so it's, I've got one more little then, bit somewhere. Um, it says, she thinks it will be nice to have all of them um, together in a booklet form for easier reference and to work through one by one. Yeah. Yeah, that, that, that's the plan. Yeah. That is the plan. But, yeah. Yay! We are, as you guys um, know, those of you who's been here a while, know that... Um, we have now started i'm gonna sort of finish now so sort of without the bias but um we used to have an uh a assistant and we don't have her anymore so things that we sort of planned and thought we would do quicker has now yeah 
a bit of a back burner. Yes, because we are actually physically. We are. It's still happening. We are physically working, guys. We literally. It's not like, yeah, all the work um, that the assistant did, we now have to um, do. So we're back uh, six months ago, and we can't now um, employ a, a person with, you know. I don't want to sound like a weirdo, but we don't know what this whole power thing and Alice, yeah, so we need to just get through the winter and then we can always. But um, the book is not going to take that long. Yeah. It is on my to do list. Yes. It will happen soon. Um, yeah, and um, by by end of winter, we will be yeah looking looking at employing someone again so that we can actually do slightly more i don't know uh creative things new plans because you know if you you spend your day doing admin you are not making new you're not doing new things and getting new ideas okay this is done i just need to do the Mm -hmm. Tanya is asking what we're doing. Tanya, it's a Japanese style craft apron that Amanda is sewing. Yes. If you want, you can look on YouTube or Facebook. The live should still be there later to follow from the beginning, which might make it a little bit easier to follow through. Facebook. Um, I'm also putting a picture on the screen because I've now loaded it. So it's coming. Okay, so this, this, weird, this, is this um, ice cream color is obviously not mine. <laughs> What did I do? What did I do? Did I do this wrong? No, I didn't. It, it, it literally, I mean, I mean, it's, it's always like that with something that crosses over for, for a moment there, you get like, what did I do? Okay. So this is obviously mine, my coloring. There we go. <laughs> Similar, but not the sound. Yeah. And also what's nice about it is actually, you know, if you, I don't, I, as I said, we are not potters. Don't, 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 don't misunderstand me. But, you know, you're working on a table and I find that if I buy an apron in the shops, it literally, I don't know, it's like an extra small, but they don't have sizes. So it literally doesn't, you know, if you like, cover your a little bit of ass, it's like, yeah. Swear. Ah. That is done. Obviously, it hasn't been hemmed. Um, uh, yeah. Are oh, you planning to hem it? I'm gonna do it now. I. We have what is it? Twenty minutes, and then so yeah. yeah. Mm. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> and and you know what? Let me show you, Bianca. If you wanted to do oh, geez. if you wanted to do side pockets. And also, this is going to use a lot of fabric. But if you wanted to do side pockets, what I would do is, on the pattern, just get this center. And then there. Get that. Oh, oh well, it's almost like perfect there. Eh? All right. And then I would actually, okay. I'll make um, this two separate pattern pieces so that it has like a a seam on the the side and then you can actually have inseam pockets but you can also just have those patch pockets on top but yeah so I have to camera from the I'm telling you. I told you it's a very easy thing. Just the bias Remember, bias. I told you before we started that is not the bias. It's a very easy pattern, and um, it doesn't. It, you know, I mean, I'm still the bias binding is still. If you're not bias binding, it's just you hem the whole thing all the way around, and then it's done. And I'm 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 starting to get hot again. You see, look. Dangerous. Dangerous. Mm -hmm. Lisa, you, Lisa, you sing so well if you sing that you're going to get copyright strike. 
<laughs> that is a lie. <laughs> that is, that is going to be that one. Yeah. Um, I'm thinking um, we also, uh, I'm thinking if we have any new, we have some new stuffies, mm -hmm. but, hmm? Oh, yeah. Um, well, we've had quite a few requests. We now have online the Italian pattern maker. Um, so if you go in on our website, there is a pattern making section and um, the Italian pattern making um, it. I want to say it's yes. I think I am obviously having a flash here now. Um, what's this light anyway um and it's a teach yourself pattern making but um that that is that it's the pattern making that i i um use only pattern making system and it is also much easier than any other pattern making system and um it the fit is very very good um the problem with um pattern making as a whole is that it all works out it's all hunky dory until you uh, i don't want to say outside until you have a shape that is different to being in proportion 100 percent. so if you have like big boobs or big butts or anything or overweight or underweight um the other pattern making systems are um they just i don't know they just don't fit well um this yeah i've i've actually the minute i i i, I was taught to do this pattern making system i i literally could have thrown out the other book because i i've never used it again ever 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 um, um i am doing a one fold simple hem because um as i said this is actually going to be used for pottery tomorrow night and um i'm not i'm not this i'm not wanting to win a competition for apron oh. i might win a pottery competition soon <laughs> yeah she was yeah um i find that um on, on things like this the simple hem is better because um, if you if if I double 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 this fabric now, what sometimes happens is it actually makes the hem um, quite hard. So then you get like a a weird stiffness to it. So something I would actually um, you could also do, and I've previously done it on other aprons that I've made, is you don't actually have to hem it. You can just um, I'll, I'll show you now on the other one because this one seems now almost done but is to just on the edge so either a bit of ribbon or a piece of lace or um, some some trim um, but I, even that makes the hem um, stand a little bit too much to my uh, Christmas aprons. I yeah. really like those. Yeah, we did some frills. We have a we have a normal apron that's actually a Christmas apron, but I mean it's a it's it's an apron that's unisex, um, and there's also kitty sizes, um, and that one um, actually you we did put a, a, a frill on. You're right on the edge. So I mean you could you could shorten this um, quite a bit, and then still. Um, add a little bit of a frill to it. I mean, nothing stops you from. Oh, mine looks like ice cream. Right? Yeah, it does. It does. Uh, oh yeah. So the Italian pattern making we now have. It is quite expensive. Uh, I, you know, I, I say things like that, and then I, I shouldn't say that because people are have different. They might think it's not expensive, and then I've gone and said it's expensive. It's it is not cheap, but I promise you, it is it is the best best system. And as I said, it literally 
um, the book actually says teach yourself and I also um, personally is busy I am busy with a I call it I, I call it a crib note but it's probably a cheat sheet to make it even easier any of my students are here they will know the crib notes because they all had that book and um, it literally is a step by step by step how to um, but I yeah I love the Italian pattern making it's very very cool so if you wanted to ever do anything like that we now can help you with that also <laughs> Making clothes that fit me better and better stitching too because some shop stitching and quality is like it was done by a sponsor. Yeah, you know, that's very true. Okay. And we accept that, man. I mean, most people, and then when you sew, you have this extremely high standard. Um, you know, you unpicking and you fixing, and, um, and then you, I mean, you buy clothes and you look at how they were made, and I'm just appalled sometimes and as you read so you percent of the locker that you have on the website yes the that's five, a, two fifty four d two five oh four d yeah now be uncounted for us oh. <laughs> uh, and you can't really sell crib, your crib notes in the future um yes i am <laughs> oh, I didn't do that. everything is is on my list i have started but it is, um, I actually need your input um, to tell me if, if it can stay like it is or if you want, should we redesign? So, um, one day, what's happening? The main uh, camera. Are you not going? Um, yeah, so you. I am busy with it because um, I, I develop, I was developed, that sounds so, um, my um it for my students um because firstly um but the italian pattern making method um they have actually the, the book has been redone but um i i made that because the book was so like old and not not very descriptive um so i did that to help my students so that they don't have to buy the book um, as the book is, is also a few bucks. Yes, we will get them. But, but yes, I am. We will probably have the last two patterns afterwards. <laughs> it will be easier. Yeah. Anyone who wants to work for free, of course. You can pitch us. We, 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 we can help you out. We are here every Monday to Friday. Yeah. To five. We are willing to pay you in experience. We are willing to pay you in, um, what is it? Publicity. And sewing talk. We will sit you, like, we will post about you on socials. Once. What is that thing when they like. Exposure. exposure. I'll pay you in exposure. We'll pay you in exposure. Yeah. Yeah, we will expose you to. We'll pay you in kind. We'll just be nice to you. That's what we'll do. I mean, I'm willing to pay them in anything. Willing and able. Yeah, me. Okay, guys, that that we might have to pay you in money, honestly. Well, soon, yeah, just. Um. That is that. I hope. Um, if you guys uh make one, please show it on the group. And especially if you make it to look like a actual slightly more, you know what I saw also, I saw this one, um, this made in jeans and a uh, repurposed or re whatever, you know, like old jeans. And um, it was so cute because they, all the pockets they put on it uh, were like from an old jeans. That's a good idea. Yeah. Is, is, is she, she's warming up. Um. Bianca says, haha, ha, I'm already working on the WhatsApp groups. Yes, Bianca, you're being fully paid in exposure. Is she working? We are making you famous. <laughs> thank you, Bianca, is all WhatsApp I'm saying. When you reach a million subscribers. I'm saying you thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. And, um, yeah. 
Hey man, I wish we could see the future and then we could just know that everything's gonna be hunky dory and we are gonna make lots of money and we can employ some people and yeah. Well, we but have, you like fabricate soon is like 24 requests to join right now, so obviously something something, something is working. Something is happening. What do you think has requests? Request to join. The group. Yeah. Yes, I know. I advertise for that. Oh, There's do... like a, a new feature on WhatsApp groups that um, people can request to join instead of just joining outright. So for all our OGs that were there with all the porn and the spam, <laughs> yeah, hopefully now that they're is it again, that won't happen. It's sorted. I thought Lisa would be like, all oh, my OGs, I've lost my source of free porn. Yeah. So, please. <laughs> <laughs> so... So I'm just. But it I'm, needs to be working because I already kicked out a guy from where was it Nigeria because I looked up his cell phone number and it was a Nigeria. What was his name? Oh. Like, like Moses. Joseph, Moses, or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I'm getting tangled into this. So that's a nice picture. So if you guys, the OGs, you'll remember all the porn we got. It's like at night, I would be asleep and wake up to like ten thousand messages from <laughs> everyone going, "Please porn on the group." Ah, uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> Now, if only we can get that on Insta for when we... Oh, guys, we do have some news. We are getting ready to do a giveaway. Same thing. So, possibly within... Yeah, before the end of the month, no, at least. <laughs> work in progress it might be right <laughs> after the <laughs> but right before we do online sewing classes <laughs> jesus lisa no it's a work in progress we have the machine picker we had you just gave it away, away. okay but you guys you guys are allowed to know things before other people i thought she already said that no i didn't no no lisa just exposing us like that okay that is two aprons done we can pop tomorrow night. I pot very often. Okay, guys, I mean. let's, <laughs> let's take five minutes and give me. We we've got some suggestions from last week, and I'm I'm actually making a list because I am completely run out of ideas. But I know we had a bucket hat. <laughs> this is list is I don't know. She loses the list. She's worse than me. Okay, so we have a bucket hat. Um, we had a, a pig bag to hang um, on, you know, for your washing pigs. So if you can think of anything, now is the time. We we have a list from last week, but I don't have baby clothing. Not gonna happen. No, that was it. Oh, but I didn't read it because I don't know what she was responding. Yeah, to. no, we don't do clothing. We don't do baby. <laughs> not anymore. Babies are out. Clothing um, is out. But uh, pottery is in. Yeah, we um I'm, I I don't do projects that take that that I can't um sort of prepare like I did these beforehand, and um that take more than one live because as things are, we don't know if we're gonna have live next week with the internet problems and the power are not, problems. Are we and not the, keeping live next week? I don't know. I don't know either. It's, it's on okay. the website. When is your birthday? Twenty sixth. Next, next week. Is that next week? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We're skipping next week. Okay. Next week is a skip. So see if that that's the reason. And there's too many things that can happen. Literally, I mean, we were we we moved in here October. We had no internet problems, right? Yes. Not a single one until three weeks ago. Three weeks ago, we could not stream at all. So I. I mean, but so so I've had, mind. as I said, I have had conversations and emails, and I don't know. They're gonna put an antenna on, and now today, someone said, but maybe the antenna is not gonna be the solution. And then he started saying that he thinks it's the program we're using. But if you get two or three <laughs> megs, ne? Is it megs or gigs? 
I don't know, but two or three instead of, I mean, at home, I've got like 200. Um, then whatever program you're going to run is not going to work. So the first problem it, to solve is the actual internet, getting the internet. And I mean, yeah. So as I said, we had four months of no problems. And, yeah. and now it's suddenly. Really inventing problems. Every time we solve something. I mean, here we are tonight. We're giving you Bit of above <laughs> every cloud. <but laughs> the streaming software that has never once crashed. Crashed. It has never once crashed. But we did it add something. Never. So, I mean. You can know it's working. Yeah, I don't know. No, I'm, I'm over it. it. What is happening here? People are still joining. Instagram people always join and leave and join. Oh, and leave okay. Okay. Um, can can you put that on your list? A coin purse. Um, we've pouch. done a coin purse. I think so. We've well, done a card purse. No, you no. don't need to do it with a card purse. You make one like my wallet. You must copy the pattern that my wallet is because my wallet is really pretty. Cool. Okay. Put it on the list. Yes. Put it on the list. Um, what about a simple patchwork table runner we can use for machine table cover as well? Machine table cover. What? Oh, patchwork table. So would that be like four things? Yeah. We haven't done that before. It, we, you know why? I'm, I mean, quilting is not difficult. I'm, I'm, I'm not a big quilter, so I'll be googling before. Yeah, I won't pretend to to know the 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 quilting patterns out of my head, but um. I, we can do quilting. We can do a quilt, uh, a quilt, uh, yeah, table runner. Um, why is why why are you doing that? <laughs> why not? I look yeah, like a not... I look like a minion. Okay. It's like a minion. Okay. <laughs> why? <laughs> okay, guys. Uh, you have three more minutes. Give me um, ideas. Yes, you guys say goodbye to me and Lisa. We're not going to be here for a month. For fabric washing baskets. We've done, um, Ashley, we've done baskets. We've done actually quite a few baskets. So that would just be making the pattern bigger. Putting plastic so Well, yeah. But yeah, we've done quite a few fabric easy, baskets. Easy. But um, put it on, put it on there. We can. So what is this? Cushion. So. So you know, just a cushion. Yeah, cushion again. <laughs> but um, we never did the zip tutorials we have. The one zip tutorial we have is really good. Well, don't say that on Instagram. Is going to throw you off. Can't hear me the mic. Okay, listen. Uh, put a cushion there. But uh, so we can do a cushion, but then do the zip tutorial again. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but we have to, yeah, because those were right at the beginning. We can do that, yeah. Um, um, Carmen Delport says hi. Hi, Carmen. Ashley says Matthew looks like that meme guy. That meme yeah. guy, what is that? There's a specific meme, I can't remember what exactly it's called. What is his name? Batman? Who's Batman? Who's Batman? <laughs> yeah. Michael Keaton, Ben Affleck. Yes, Ben Affleck. Affleck where he's like standing on the outside of the. Oh, that's right. Ben, you have know. you have you guys heard this? But it's Ben Affleck. I don't think he's applicable, but other people do, obviously. Um, okay. for a makeup bag like I sent to Lisa. Oh yes. What did you send to Lisa? Oh, Lisa's list. Put it on her list. Which makeup bag is that? It did it not look like we what we've already done? I can't remember. I do remember she sent me something. Oh, I did ignore. I. Oh, I, I, oh. <laughs> oh, that's that's such a. You were. <laughs> so like, I was not gonna post Let me the see. message. You know the that's funny you, the funny thing is I actually. I swear I um. I had a pattern. I, I looked at a tutorial for that a while ago. So yes, what is that? What is it called? It's, it's like, like a triangle, cute. triangle zip open makeup bag. Let's put it like that. Um, oh, I can show you that on my screen as well. Show it on my little screen. Little screen. What is she doing? No, that's not. Is it working? Indeed. Yeah, it is working, and it opens up. Like a big mouth. See? 
it doesn't yeah okay but it's that's fine i actually have it and i also want to do i i told you i also want to do that um sort of one full live of of, of easy and simple and funny and sewing hacks yes um i i have a few and i recently found a few and i keep sending them to myself because i'm thinking oh, i gotta show you guys that oh, i gotta show you guys this oh, i gotta show and the more you see of that the more they show yeah. you so you're like ah oh, so many things mm. um ask everyone and we'll also look trying out tiktok sewing hacks trying them out like proving or disproving what is it like but that's the cat cat book pack but that's what i want to do i have all of these i sent me myself all these videos so i literally want to go through them and see which ones work yo because they look so amazing yeah but um, you have to do it as she said bibs did we do bibs question mark bibs like baby bibs no we didn't do that no but we that's i'll just do it quick quick snack Fast <laughs> Yeah, we can do baby bibs. That's that's not difficult. Metal snap fast knives. Yeah, those those are <laughs> pro- problematic. Add a little dummy thing into it because we sell those too. Mm. Yeah. Okay, guys. Bandana for doggies. Oh, that's also very easy. We've done oh, that. Bianca, Bianca's been making doggy stuff. What is it? Did she make doggy jackets? Yeah, she did. Everyone on the group. Everyone wants. Spoiling your baby. Everyone wants um, a doggy uh, a jacket, and the problem is my doggies are great days. So oh, a kitty jacket. Oh, mama. No. Guys, we've literally had this conversation before. Oh, yes, yeah, this exact conversation. Jacket, no, so. I'm not making cat jackets. Yeah, I don't it's, like cats. Um, my anyway. So every dog jacket. I mean, I can. Can you? Can you explain that to them then? How to make a cat jacket? Um, every dog, the shape is different. I have dogs that are this big and I have a jacket for them, but I don't know how, I don't know how to take that pattern down to a Yorkie. I've never had a Yorkie. So your best bet with, with doggy, because the shapes are so different. Some dogs are longer and shorter and taller and better and thinner uh, is to really i i found my jacket well i didn't find the pattern but i saw a drawing and then i sort of made my own pattern but there are patterns on the online for free guys they're gonna throw us out we um, must finish okay, so nicole now stole uh-huh. my idea but i'm gonna first say why don't you do because one of the classes we've been doing recently was sewing classes and we haven't actually had a pattern making class with the mm-hmm. camera working properly so why don't you do a pattern making class for the doggy jacket so you can like go on measure your dog and show them how you would cross it out and stuff who's gonna help me measure my dog nothing i can't dogs can't stand still but around the world make up a dog it doesn't have to be. Yeah. Oh, I, we and can do that. And show them yeah. how to draw the pattern for their specific size. The dog is two meters Man. long <laughs> and one meter tall. It's a terrified <laughs> dog. Um, okay, guys. Um, Japanese not bad. But write it down. I will go after the fact. I have nothing near me. Actually, said quilted coasters. That's a we, cute idea. Did we not do? No. I will. You know those. Um, we did uh, oven that, mitts. Those we did oven mitts. And we did a, uh, a, a what's the big coaster then under your plate? Yeah, Place so match. Place match. Good. Yeah, but we can do coasters. Yeah, that would be cute. That, I mean, Japanese Bianca not bad. Snap buttons on my poison. Bianca said doggy jacket, easy to make. Make one for the kitty. Uh, <laughs> um, actually, say Japanese not bad. See, you know, I that I know that no no it's it is sewing. I know that bag. And that bag frustrates me because what do you do with it? It is tiny, firstly. Secondly, you are knotting it into the other one and then you only have... I don't understand the fascination with that bag. You know how many students I had? How many? I had at least 15 students wanting me 
to show them how to design the pattern. And I, honestly, it's like you it's like, and then you pull the one arm further. Yeah, but the one arm is longer than the other arm, so it can't ever I'll be. Balance and can you see that the straps are s sitting exactly wrong so you can't you can't do the straps are like this remember you last week i said this strap must go from side to side yes. so that's yeah but yeah anyway, that's okay that's not difficult i mean it's not difficult we can do that we can do that nicole says can you teach us how to measure dogs for jackets so i will bring our jackets Yeah. I will I will look <laughs> into the dog fine. jackets because obviously I did it. I just don't think Well, I made a jacket for Coco and then I made one for Odin also, but Odin just got out of it and ate it. <laughs> and then he started then he started ripping hers, undressing her and ate hers. So I haven't done just jacket doggy jackets again. <laughs> Ashley said it's worn with a kimono. Obviously, kimono is the thing, so you can't really yeah. wear a handbag with a kimono, so you would need a Japanese knot bag. That makes so much sense, Ashley. Yeah. It just blew my mind. Yeah. Please, I, I don't know how to make a kimono. Don't ask me. <gasps> That's a good idea. Yeah. No, Matthew. It's like cultural appropriation. I'm not allowed to make it. Um, so, some person in the chat said kimono. It was me. <laughs> uh -huh. um, Ashley said it will go with today's apron. Um, Bianca, Nicole, do you want our WhatsApp group? Yep, do you want our WhatsApp group? www.fabricate.co.za WhatsApp to it. Okay. Um, Amanda can make it bigger. What bigger? I think the, the, the dog. Yeah. The bag or the dog. I, I, I just, I don't know. I, it's one of those <laughs> things. I think the students just irritated me with this bag and, and I just got it like a pain, a pain there where you don't want to paint for this bag. Because I couldn't understand why would you want this bag? Bianca said, knot bag is like a checkered shop bracket. Just on one side longer than the other. Yeah. <laughs> it's just the opposite. Exactly what it is. Exactly. Um, okay, goodbye guys. Okay. They're gonna literally um, lock us out here tonight. See you next week. Okay, Bye. no. See you not next week. Well, Did we well, not well, just me, decide me, there is no next yeah. week? Yes. Me and Lisa won't see you for months. They're going on holiday. And they're leaving me with this. The system. Yeah, we must take a video of everything. We need to train people some point next week. We need to come for training. I don't know. I don't know if we can ask your brother to do this. Luckily, he's got a significant other. Yeah. No, that's all. And Laura, by the way. She's nicer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. Bye. Bye. Instagram, you're right behind there. And um, is it not? Is Bye. it not? Um, did we ask about the noise? Did it go away? It went. It went down. Yeah. The people. Yeah. <laughs> Poo emojis. Yeah, my favorite pink ones. Right. Thank you, Bianca. Bye, YouTube. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye. See ya.